Michael, Michael, amor mío, ¿dónde te encuentras, Michael? What the hell is this? Harris supporter. Phew, thank you. I was beginning to think no one was going to say it. This had Kamala voter all over it. <laughs> oh, look, another smooth brander who sniffs Trump's ring. You don't get it that the planet house with laughter every time one of you steps into the light. Ooh, do you struggle with comprehension? The world is sick of seeing childish comments about American politics. For Sake, give me some rest. This isn't making me upset at all. It's actually quite funny. Not gay, no. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What is this? This is a man? Bro, you're a man doing this. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't know what the hell they got going on in Taiwan, bro. I can't infuse that dog in you, but you're gonna have to have it if you're gonna win in this league. If you're gonna be. This nigga mouth is crazy, bro. He look like Kevin after he got stung by them jellyfish. Now that we on the topic, shut the fuck up about Sky Jackson and her baby daddy. Huh? Leaving the gym, no my ass fat, waist is slim, but no one will ever see it because I live in baggy jeans. I just looked at your profile and you lied to me. I mean, bro, what did you expect? She's a woman. Me showing the cop the illegal immigrant in my class on January 20th. Oh, Lord. I don't think these comments are gonna piss me off today, I'm not gonna lie. This might be a long ass video. Yeah, super long video! If these comments don't fucking load! America was born by immigrants, just saying. Mm. Even illegal immigrants are privileged. Privileged in our country. Even a illegal, even a illegal, illegal. Who the f thought it was a great idea to offer them zero down on zero percent on a house, while the burn and raise America can't even afford a rent an apartment, let alone pay a mortgage. Not many folks will come and sense out here, my friend. LOL. Your master is about to grab you by your gussy, and you'll be okay. These comments aren't gonna upset me, not those, bro. Looking at him after he says he has a girlfriend, but he paid for his own haircut and nobody bought him Black Ops 6. Who's letting their girl pay for them? Right. Home record AQ. Karma's real and one day you'll receive it. Bro, I don't think it was that serious. Hey, hold up. It was crazy, like, on the computer. Everything just looks better. Avoid dating. Coworkers. Friends ex, your ex, party girls, single moms, what else? I'm a single mom, why I'm a red flag, the father of my child died years ago. Okay, you didn't have to say that, you didn't have to comment that. Why, why do people say stuff like this on the internet? Blacks, <laughs> what? Why would, you, why would you say this? The self-hate from black men needs to be studied. You have a picture of your black mom and sister on your Instagram. The nerve to say that, please. Get some help and heal. I mean, bro, I don't get when people say this. Like, bro, I don't want to fuck my mom or sister. I don't want to date my mom or sister. So what's the point of bringing them up? Yeah, those comments aren't going to piss me off. Without saying what the category is, name your top five. Alexis Texas, Tyler the Creator, Zach Bryan, Kevin Durant, and Kanye West. What is this criteria? Wait, Kevin Durant and Alexis. Let's just... <laughs> What is this criteria? People who don't fuck with black people? Alexis Texas and Kevin Durant. My top five is performers of all time. <laughs> that has so much potential to be funny. What's a major green flag in a Toronto girl? Nobody, nothing, broski. Just stays at home. Like me, I can go out, do whatever the f I want. She has to be at home. Why are these bads dissing, broski? Security, yo, if I'm caught. Talking about the Toronto accent, fam. When I was young, I used to jump for joy and say, oh yeah, Obama, black president, that's so amazing, he's the same color as me. However, one of the biggest questions I had was, why is Obama in the same party as the people that started the KKK, the same people that voted against the Civil Rights Act, the same people that are on the news talking about how black people aren't able to accomplish anything and need to be on welfare? This kid is lost. Elaborate there. If you think that you're lost, switching parties is only frowned upon because that's what the parties don't. 
want. Republicans and Democrats both don't care about us as much as everyone thinks. People just need to be open-minded and think for themselves. This is true. This is not this isn't gonna upset me at all. This is just reconfirming what I already know. The fact that Obama and several other black politicians are part of the Democrat Party is literally proof that the party switch happened. This kid needs to go back to school. He clearly wasn't researching the right questions. Damn, 400 replies, bro. You gotta put your shit on Do Not Disturb. Black Americans used to vote Republican. Then government decided to provide welfare programs to black communities and instantly black people. Alright, this is like too, too political. Things that are too, too political aren't gonna really upset me. <laughs> That's not 800 pounds, woman. Why would you just, why would you say that? You obviously don't know how much it weighs. Since you just said 800 pounds, it probably weighs less than him. Where does she get 800 pounds from? I'm getting angry. <laughs> I'm getting angry. However, that did not seriously angry. 14 year old Ahmed Mohammed took his homemade digital clock to show his new engineering teacher. I took it to school to show my teachers the talent that I had. It didn't look like a bomb. The Muslim student was handcuffed in the hall. 14. Batman beats Iron Man. I mean, do they both have prep time? Sure. No, he doesn't. Not a you think Iron Man wins? Absolutely. Obviously. He the floor with him. What are you doing? Take it and go. What you doing? You just let him take it. <laughs> what the hell is that? Another butter? We're doing all that for another butter? Black women are the best. Because they always ask you, you know what I'm saying? Imagine there are still some women in the world who care about if you understand them instead of keeping talking nonsense. I'ma still go for my white women. Bless your heart. Oh, uh, she's but You look gay, so it doesn't even matter. Like, all right, why are you getting on this? Why are you getting on him if you don't want him anyways? What's your go-to microfeminism? I call myself and other women, women, not girls. Refusing to yield to men when they're walking down the street. When a man's getting aggressive, I- You're not even a girl! Look like a gay-ass 25-year-old Barack Obama. Hit him with the, I can see you're acting a little emotionally. Let's think a little more logically, like me. This might do Thanks it. To take I don't watch a lot of sports, but when I do, I try to put on women's sports to help their ratings and to lift women's sports. What? I don't watch a lot of sports. If you don't watch a lot of sports, you're not lifting the women's sports. To hold the door open for men and insist they go in first. Okay. Being friendly senses with Lil Man. Why would you call me that though? Why would you call me Lil Man? What did I do to you? I know for sure I could stuff your little ass in a locker. Who are you calling Lil Man? I call God she. It's like, alright, bro. How much ego does one need to have, bro? to do something like that if you cannot rock her sugar box there will be issues if, if you, you cannot, cannot rock, rock her, her sugar, sugar box, box there will, will be issues. issues i know he's gonna repeat hey that. sigma i saw you mewing in the mirror is that because you think you're skibbity surveillance video from inside the restaurant shows a table of 16 people eating and enjoying 16 people dine and dash on a 420 restaurant bill let's do the math on that $26, bro. There's no need to dine and dash on $26. And they're all African American. Let's see what the comments look like. Is anyone surprised? It's the usual suspects. 400 replies, bro. Actually, yeah, I am. Because I have never. And no, no one who's ever done this. So yeah, I am surprised. Damn, so we're laboring now? I've been black for 36 years. LOL. And I know no one. Who is black that have done this? Bro, obviously. Does this show the, like, the whole 400 something replies though? And you guys cried BLM? What does that have to do with Black Lives Matter? Bro, you would think, you think things like this is trolling, but it's actually like, this is actually people's mindset to say stuff like this when it comes to a dining dash. Black Lives Matter as a business, it's fictitious. It's despicable. I don't like it, but like how the people perceive Black Lives Matter is something totally different. I guess the restaurant didn't accept EBT or coupons. Bro, you're literally a minority too, bro. You're Hispanic. I really don't get minorities being racist towards each other, bro. I don't get anybody being racist towards anybody. And folks get mad when you stereotype. 
Stereotyping is for idiots, though. They'll say it's pattern recognition. Nah, no, bro, it's just retardation. How come it's not pattern recognition when people on TV and suits and ties and smiles on their face take 40% of your earnings and spend it on wars? Where's the pattern recognition then? Did that upset me? I think it did. But was that enough to end the video? That didn't upset me. It was more so upset on the level of intelligence. I please my man in every way. If he's at the dentist, I make him nut. If he's at J. Crew returning a sweater, he's nutting. If he's trying on another sweater, he's getting a nut. If he exchanged that old sweater for the new sweater, he's nutting. What, what brought you out here today? My, my wife, right? We're in a polyamorous relationship. The lover that my wife took is African American. And like, I've learned so much about the struggle that people of color go through as a result of uh, my wife's boyfriend. And so I'm is this nigga what? Look, uh, uh. I decided to really do my part to show solidarity for my marginalized communities. And, like, the best way to do that is to get the first woman of color to be the commander in chief. And I'm really excited. I'm so pumped. Like I said, we have the first woman of color to be president of the United States. And, like, you know, our country it was founded on the, on the values of diversity, equity, and inclusion. And, and That's enough!